boys and girls. Welcome to our first printing lesson. It's printing lesson one. And today we're learning how to print the lowercase skyline letters. T, it's lowercase T, lowercase B, and lowercase F. Okay, the sky, another name for the skyline, if, you, um, if you're using this foundations paper, we call it the skyline because this is the skyline as you learned in our intro video. But if you're using regular handwriting paper, the skyline is just the top line, which is this one right here, okay? You will be using a pencil. So again, we already learned how to properly grip, flip, and hold a pencil, okay? So you'll get your pinchers, your okay pinchers ready. Pick up your pencil, flip it over in your hand, use an extra finger for support and then you're ready to go okay since i'm going to be doing many lessons on my paper i'm actually using dry erase foundations paper to show you how to print the lowercase letters today so you'll notice that instead of a pencil i'm going to be using a dry erase marker okay but i'm going to be doing the same thing to print the letters that you are going to be learning and trying on your own at home so lowercase skyline letters. The first one is letter T. T stands for the sound T. Okay, here's how we make a letter T. Since these are the skyline letters, or the top line letters, we are going to begin at the very top or skyline. Okay, so we are going to point to the sky line or the top line with your pencil. Sorry, I'm trying to get a good zoom, good focus for you. There we go. Okay, so you're gonna point your pencil to the top sky line. Then you're going to go straight down to the grass line and then cross on the middle or also called the plane line, okay? I'll show you again next to the number two. So we point our pencil on the top skyline, come straight down to the grass line, and then you cross it on the middle line or the plane line. Okay, there's T. My second one's a lot better, and it was a lot quicker than my first. All right, so all together, you're just doing two strokes. One, two. Okay, so you make your line, starting at the top or the skyline, point your pencil, go straight down to the grass line or the bottom line. Then you cross right over the plain line or the middle line. Okay, so it's just one, two. Okay, and the sound for T is T. So if you're just watching the first time for practice and you're not ready to try it on your own yet, that's okay. You can do it with me using your magic writing finger. You can write it in the sky. You can pretend like you have the paper in front of you and just follow along with the video using your magic pointer finger. Okay. T. T. Okay, so that is lowercase sky letter T. The next one I'm going to show you is the lowercase skyline letter B. Okay, B stands for the sound B. B is a consonant, okay, just like the letter T and F. Consonants are all the letters except for the vowels A, E, I, O, U. Okay, so all three of our skyline letters today are actually consonants. Our next lowercase letter is the letter B. B is also a lowercase skyline or top line letter because it's tall like the letter T. So again, just like we did first, we start at the top line or the skyline. Okay, so we'll put our pencil to the skyline or the top line of your handwriting paper. You're going to go straight down to the grass line or the bottom line. Then you trace up to the middle plane line and around to the grass line. OK, 
Okay, and that is the lowercase letter b. You don't have to pick up your pencil at all while you write the letter b. You just do it in one quick motion down, and without picking up your pencil, you wrap it around, just like that. Okay, the letter b stands for the sound b. Okay, say b, bat, b with me. Ready? We'll trace over it again. You can use your magic finger if you're just following along, watching the video for practice at home. Okay, so if you're not writing your, or printing your letters yet, that's okay. You can still use your magic writing finger and you can pretend like you're writing in the sky. We call it sky writing. And you can trace along with me. Okay, B, bat, b. Great. All right, let's make another one. So again, you're gonna point with your pencil, in my case, my marker, to the top line or the sky line and you go straight down to the grass line. Then you trace up to the plain line and around to the grass line again. So that you're making sort of a curved line and it connects with the first line. Okay, B, bat, B, or B, ball, B. Let's do it one more time, you ready? This time I want you to try to say the directions with me, what we're supposed to do. So I'm just going to do it slowly, but I'm going to be silent. Let's see if you remember how to write the letter. Here we go. Excellent. If you said something like this, you point to the top line or the skyline, Go down to the bottom or the grass line, trace up to the middle or the plain line, and around to the grass line. Then you are correct. Kiss your brain. Okay, and that is the letter B. So far we had the letter T, like T, top, T, and then B for B, bat, B. Okay, and our last lowercase skyline letter today is the tall lowercase letter F. F is also a consonant, and F stands for the sound f. Okay, so here is how we print the letter F the correct way. Okay, when you make a letter F, again, you're gonna take your pencil and you're gonna point to the top line or the skyline you trace back just a little bit on the skyline and then way down to the bottom or the grass line and then you cross it on the plain line. Okay, let me show you again. So you point to the skyline, you trace back on the skyline and then way down to the bottom or the grass line then you're gonna actually pick up your pencil and cross it on the middle line or the plain line. And that is the dotted line there. Okay, F is for fun. Or we can also say F, fairy, or F, fly. And the sound is Hey, okay, let's use the word fun today because I like to have fun. F, fun, excellent. Let's write it again. So you point to the top line or the sky line on your handwriting paper. You actually trace back on the sky line and then down to the grass line. Then you cross on the middle plain line and you're done. So all together it's two motions with your pencil. Where you trace back which kind of makes the hook. That's one, two. Okay. F, fun, f, excellent. Feel free to pause the video, go back and watch it from the beginning, um, repeat any of the letters that you or your child, if you notice they're having trouble parents, you can have them watch and practice as many times as you need to. And then when you're ready, 
boys and girls when you're ready, you can try writing some letters in your handwriting journal or if you're in the classroom on your foundations paper, you can try writing some of these letters on your own. Okay, I posted an activity for Seesaw, a student response template for lesson one where you can upload a picture of your letters after you're done printing your lowercase letters T, B, and F today. You can share a photo of that with me right on your student response template in Seesaw Printing Lesson 1. Okay? So again, if you need to watch the video a few more times to practice using your magic writing finger, you may do that. Um, feel free. If not, then you can go ahead on to your CISO activity and complete that. Thank you for tuning in and congratulations on learning how to print your lowercase skyline letters, T, B, and F. I hope you learned as much as I did.